I'm here with the Boeing dude today in the Redwood Forest. We're gonna try to find some giant salamanders. Uh, Morgan starts struggling against the current. When will they realize the futility of their actions? Just let the current sweep them away. Path of least resistance, a Wu Wei response. <laughs> there they go. Whoa! No, there's something here. Look, all this is on you. Let's get the camera. Sweet. Set of beats. Uh, let's flip this bark too. Which oh, one? I might ask out like. Same, dude. Oh, slender salamander. Dude, what kind of, what's, is this California? Yeah. Cal There's no, is, is Santa Cruz Mount Slender Salamander a thing? No, I don't think so. There's like a bunch of tiny little, oh, whoa, look, eggs. Oh shit. Salamander eggs, right? Caviar, dude. Mmm. <laughs> Yummy. I don't know. No, it's eat. like, it's probably in Satina, right? Probably. They're pretty big, so I'd assume so. Oh, that's the first time I've seen salamander eggs, I think. It's kind of cool. Let's check out this log. Oh, they. All right, Ancetina, slender salamanders. All right. Ideal habitat log. That banana slug, bro. It's not a banana. Oh, the banana. What are you talking about? <laughs> I only saw the worm. Oh, yo, look. Oh, and Satina? Why is it so orange? Oh, there's a big ass slender salamander, too. Look. Dude, it's, oh, fuck. It's, it's a productive a, it's log. Productive log, there you go. Slender salamander. Most common salamander by far in the redwood forest. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoops. It, this is a very large one very small they're lungless salamanders that's why they're so small so they have an important niche in the undergrowth community and here's the Ensatina, also lungless larger though and more colorful and it can secrete toxins when it gets disturbed they are known as a uh, ring species in that um the state of California has a very uh, ring-shaped distribution of these salamanders. Um, but each segment of the ring is a different species, which is very interesting. Many different subspecies. This one, I believe, is the yellow eyes and satina. Sweet. Can I talk about the banana slug? Oh, the banana slug. <laughs> the UCSC mascot. And that's about it. We'll show you. Alright, I'll the weakness of their mascot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Check out this centipede and slender salamander. So Larry, what are your emotions right now? Alright, this is completely unreal. We've been searching for this so long, I can't even believe my eyes. The, the thickness, the size <laughs> of this giant salamander, it all just blows me away. And on top of that, it's its cute face. It just invites me to, to pet it. It's chunky body. <laughs> the myth is real. Considering the relatively small size and also the very paddle-like tail of the specimen, it may be not quite neonetic, but perhaps in its proverbial teenage years. Also very slimy as you can see. <laughs> Disgusting. Pretty cool though. So this is a juvenile California giant salamander. So this is actually, after the coastal giant salamander, this is actually the largest terrestrial salamander in the world. So this can actually grow up to a length exceeding a foot. So this is a very massive salamander. 
and you even though it's a juvenile you can already see its significant size it's already larger than all the other animals or all the other salamanders we've seen today and this salamander is a vicious predator it uh those other salamanders we saw today would be its prey and it also eats small invertebrates and other creatures under these logs and banana slugs as well so this is definitely a creature not to be reckoned with and it also has a ferocious bite oh it's gonna move oh, shit. all right yeah very cool creature four toes on the front foot five on the back and salamanders can actually also regenerate their limbs which makes them uh very interesting to to people studying medicine so people are actively researching this it's like lizard in the spider-man regenerating his limbs so this has great potential time for the release let's be gentle with his tender oh shoot all right i'll encourage him to crawl back under the log what right. it's very active come on oh Alright, he's making his way. Alright. There goes the legend. This banana slug has gone rotten, as evidenced by the brown spot. Oh, I already checked this one. Oh, you did? Oh, don't I feel special? All right, help me look. What's it? Oh! Wow. All right, help me look. All right. There you go. We just caught this arboreal salamander near the dunes under that log. Very sharp teeth. Hopefully this one doesn't bite. This is actually a lungless salamander as well, but it's unusually large. If you look at his triangular head, it has very powerful jaw muscles. Also has a prehensile tail that it uses to climb. Well, you probably shouldn't step in those in the native plants. Oh, yo, garter snake. Oh, really? Oh, shit. Huh, nice. Coast, coast garter snake. Oh, okay. I mean, obviously. <laughs> Sweet. Hey, look at those red spots, bro. It's gonna freaking musk on me. Whatever. Just caught my first snake that's gonna be in one of my videos. Gotta live up to the Snake Man 01 name. This is a Coast Garter snake. I just caught it in the, uh, the brushy area right there by the log. A very nice juvenile, docile. I'm sure, it loves to be handled. It enjoys the, my, the gentle caress of my fingers. This snake is very colorful in its own right. But compared to its cousin, the San Francisco garden snake, it pales in comparison. Uh, that snake features blue and red stripes. It is found in marshland in this in San Mateo County and Santa Cruz County. Unfortunately, its numbers have been reduced by introduced American bullfrogs, which have reduced the population of its main prey item being the red-legged frog. So we would be very happy, but also not expectant to see one today. Oh, oh damn! Oh, big darkling oh. beetle. Snake. Oh whoa, dude, that's fucking oh, huge. It's a large beetle, oh, yeah, bro. There's a cricket too. What is, is this? Is this a, like a? Is that a poop? Yeah, I think so. It's 
pretty big. Let's put him back. Oh. oh, Jerusalem cricket. Oh, gross, dude. Oh, fucking man, the boys are biting the shit out of yeah. that stick. Dude, holy, we would have been fucked if we grabbed it. Alright, I don't want to push it. Alright, put it back. Are you sure? Yeah. Kind of cool. I think we just caught another Coast Guard or snake. Same, same as before, except very small, small juvenile. Thank you.